Digo, <risa> yes. está una, en Radio Chuck está una en promoción como, como 7.99, 8 dólares creo. De verdad, voy sí. a ir un día de esto a buscar. Sí, ahí compré una yo es básica, pero funciona muy bien. Sí, yo solo creo para que... ponerla en... Sí, yo creo que me miran muy bien ahí porque es la que yo estoy usando. Sí, se mira bien, fíjese. Ajá. Fíjese que la, a mí el año pasado, el, el año pasado me dio problema el micrófono. Lo mismo que está pasando ahorita, que gran bulla a mí así. Ay, Tuve ay. que cambiarlo. Y el que compré era más caro. Y ay, ahora ay, el que ay. compré más barato me sale mejor. Hello, teacher. Hello, hello. Ay. Happy Days Valentine, teacher. Happy Valentine's Day to you too. <laughs> All right, very good. So guys, Lucía, Paco. Good evening. Hi, Henry, Joanna. Oh. Patricia, Jorge, very good. We have a couple of people already. That's nice. We have Bonito, Sergio, Lai. Yo dije, como Valentine's Day, no, Hello. Hi, Lucía. Hello. Hi, Lucía. Good evening, Sergio Flores. How are you guys? You want to celebrate Valentine's Day with me today? <laughs> All right, very good. Hi, Joanna. Hi, Kenya. Only in the Christmas. Ah? Only in the Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> Tengo chocolates virtuales. <laughs> <laughs> así que te, si tienen una respuesta buena, le voy a hacer así, miren. Se lo voy a enseñar y me lo voy a poner. Oh. Ah. <laughs> All right, very good. Y aquí ve, happy Valentine's Day. There you go. Have a Valentine's Day. Yeah, excellent. Very good, guys. <laughs> How's teacher. everybody? Yes? Okay. Yes, alguien dijo teacher? Aquí, yo también tengo chocolates virtuales. Ah, excellent, <laughs> Claudita. Very good. <laughs> para <laughs> todos o para este? Para todos. Thank Solo que yo no voy a disfrutar. <laughs> <laughs> Exactamente. Very good. Alright, y después no voy a poder dormir porque toda Ajá. hyper voy a andar, ¿verdad? <risa> <risa> Ay, Hacerle de... No me afecta. No me afecta tampoco. Yo ya vivo hyper, así que no importa. Alright, guys, so how is everybody? Everybody's okay today? Everybody okay? Yes? Okay. Excellent, so very good. Nice, nice to know you're fine. Very good. Uh, what's that? Okay, thank you. <laughs> okay, so guys, are we ready to start? This is the last class for section four. All right, and we're going to get ready to do the midterm. Okay, guys, so please work on the midterm this weekend. Remember that you have tonight, uh, tomorrow, I guess, and Saturday and Sunday. Okay, that's the latest that you can be working on your exam. Okay, so try to do it before so you are not rushing like Cinderella antes de las dos de la medianoche que le salga la. Imagínense le va la conexión de internet. Oh my goodness. All right. So try to do it before, guys. Okay? Yes? Okay. All right. Uy, andan ahora. My goodness. I like that. Okay. Very good. So, guys, yesterday we were talking about what? Paco, do you remember what we were talking about? Voy a listar el chocolate. Espéreme, para que si lo contesta bien, me lo como. Okay, there you go. Uh-huh. Yeah, I remember we were talking about the... Uh, Position. Part, par, participles and uh, participles, yes. Participles and uh, prepositions. Very good. Okay. Uh, and we were using them as what? As modi modifiers, right? Modifiers. Mo uh, yeah, and modifiers. Modifiers with participles and um, prepositions, all right? So yeah. remember that I said that the preposition. I mean, the sorry, the modifiers are not. No, the participles are not the same as the present continuous tense. It looks like it, but it's not the same, okay? So don't get confused with a uh, present continuous tense verb, okay? So, uh, let me see. Joanna, do you remember how, how we form um, participle? Verb plus what? Verb plus ing, right? So I say dancing, I said speaking, I said looking, I said singing, all right? So remember that if the ing 
And then, Lucia, we were talking about the prepositions. Any preposition, Lucia, can you mention one, please? Lucia, your microphone is off. Thank you, Lucy. Hi, Lucy. Uh -huh. Can you tell me a, prep, a preposition, Lucia, please? Between, very good. Between. Senya, can you give me another preposition? Uh, with. With, also, very good. Another one, guys. Uh, Sergio or Flor, I don't know, I mean, uh, Flores or Ricardo. Next to. Next. Next to, very good. Anything else? In front of. In front of, all right. Behind. 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 Yes. All the prepositions that we have studied before on. can be used, yes, on. Um, uh, they can be used in this type near. of section. Far. Okay, very oh, good. Yeah. yeah, very good. Okay, so let me see. In front of. In front of, that's right. Yeah, those are the prepositions. Okay. Who's that? That's Aniva, right? I am Aniva. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's see. Um, excuse me? All right, let's see. Ricardo, can you give me a, a sentence using modifiers with participle? All right, I don't want you to use a modifier with preposition, but rather a sentence using modifier with participle. Can you give me one example, Ricardo? Uh, maybe uh, uh, my brother, uh... My brother, uh, uh, wearing wearing uh, sunglasses, is next to the window. Okay, my brother. Okay, okay, very good. Let's see, Jorgito, can you give me another example, please? Para que se gane un chocolate. Okay. Uh, he, uh, Henry. Henry is is using microphone and next to next to the Joanna. Is next to Joanna. All right, very good. So Henry is the man, or Henry is the student, or Henry is the guy. Uh, you <coughs> the microphone is standing next to Joanna. Very good. All right, let's see. Senia, can you give me another example using a participle? Hi, Michelle. Hi, Rodrigo. Welcome to class. Okay. Um, Jessica's the Korean uh, woman with dark hair. All right. Very good. Okay. Nice. All right. Anybody else, guys? Quien quiere uh, intentar hacer otra oración? Who wants to try making? Okay. Tell me, Manuel. The lamb is over the table. The lamb is over the table. All right, yeah, okay, but uh, so yeah, okay. So the, remember that what we're trying to do here is not just telling a sentence but giving the person or another person more information about what you're looking for or who you are like asking about, okay? But yeah, you're right, very good. Um, let's see, let's go on here. Um, and even I need to, I need to um, show something. <laughs> All right, because I can see your screen, Aníbal. I need to share my screen. <laughs> All right, very good. Aníbal, you're very Sorry for you, teacher. <laughs> oh, yeah. Teacher. Yes? Teacher, I have a question. Ask me. Eh, puedo decir, my notebook is on my bed. Yeah. On my bed, yes. Mi yeah, cuaderno yeah. está en la cama. Sí. Yes. Sí. Okay. All right. Now, remember that what we're trying to do here, like the, the sentences we have as examples, is we're trying to give information about someone, all right? So, uh, in that case, uh -huh. what we're talking about yesterday, she's the woman with short black hair. She's a tall one in jeans, all right? So we're trying to locate people or things so we have a reference of what we're talking about, 
All right, um, let's try to do this here. Yesterday, I was gonna show you these sentences, finish them up. Right now, I don't want you to look at any, any picture. I will show you the picture later, all right? But what I want you to do now is I want you to complete the sentences. Uh, for example, number one, who's the man sitting next to, all right? Or who's the woman wearing, or who is, or which one is? Uh, who are the people who are the ones? What I want you to do, I'm gonna send you to your groups and I want you to finish the sentence. All right, you understand what you have to do? So for example, uh, who's the man sitting next to Senia? All right, don't answer it, just complete the sentences. Or in this case, the questions. You understand what you have to do? Yeah, right now you're just completing the question. Senia, you don't understand? No? no? Okay, okay, so we have who, uh, when I say who, is it a sentence or is it a question? It's a question. It's a question, very good, very good. So I have, who's the man sitting next to? ¿Qué más le falta a esa oración, esa pregunta, Senia, para terminarse? To be finished or complete. Who's the man? Uh huh. The other people. For example, for example on the table. Who's the man sitting table? next to the table? Very good, yeah. So, lo que necesito, Seni, es que termine de hacer la pregunta. All right? Cuando las terminen de hacer, vamos a regresar. Le voy a decir qué hacer. We're going to go back to the. Uh, the breakout room so we can practice. Ahora, ahorita está como más fácil porque solo falta un poquito to finish the question. All right? So, can you please take a picture of that? So you know what to do, please? Yes. Everybody taking a picture? Thank yes. you. All right, we're ready? No. Yes. We're ready. Yeah, we're ready, all right. <coughs> Open chat today. All right. All right, guys, there you go. All right, there you go, guys. Let's start clicking on your breakout rooms, please. Okay. No. Okay. Serious, uh, serious is the teacher. Ah, serious, serious. <laughs> uh huh. So finish up the question, guys, please. Okay. okay. Who's the man sitting next to? The Jorge. The Jorge or Jorge? Jorge. Uh -huh. Next to Jorge. Jorge. <laughs> El Jorge, no, Jorge. <laughs> Ni en español, ¿verdad? Sí, ni en español. Sí, sí, yo no estuve en una clase, estaba viendo ahora la plataforma, ahora cuando ocupamos Spain, o para qué se ocupa Spain. Spain, S-P-E-N-D. ¿Ah? Puede ser, I spend money, gastar dinero, I spend my time. Gastar, así es. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Ah, ok, sí, no lo entiendo. Uh -huh. Solo que depende del contexto, Henry, porque si yo digo, I spend my time with my family, no es que gaste mi tiempo con ellos, es que paso mi tiempo con ellos. Ah, depende. So it depend uh -huh. ah. If it's money, Henry, yes, I spent twenty dollars. I spent twenty dollars yesterday. Okay. Uh -huh. uh -huh. uh -huh. Sí, que hasta ahora puedo trabajar. Ya hice las dos unidades. Mañana termino. Excelente, Henry, todo, con todos los poderes, vamos. 
todo, sí. Excelente, very good. Solo porque tiene bebé, no porque si no. No, All right, very good. Okay. Okay. Who's the woman wearing? Wearing. Wearing the. Corta. Uh -huh. Hi, uh, Michelle Alfredito. Hello. Are you finished? No. no. Come on, Michelle, you're always fat. <laughs> hey, Michelle and Freddy, you were working yesterday together. You're your travel. Yes. Good team. <laughs> Very nice. <laughs> Michelle, you're not celebrating Thanksgiving tonight. Thanksgiving, I mean, that's <laughs> yes. my goodness, I'm sorry. <laughs> I wanted to say Valentine. I'm hungry already. <laughs> <laughs> Me too. <laughs> yeah. All right. We have to celebrate. Yeah, we have to. Yeah. Maybe tomorrow or on or weekend. Saturday. Yeah, I think on the weekend. Tomorrow I'm working, so. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Very good. Okay, continue, guys. I'll shut up. I'll go away. S S E S. Glasses, no wall. Oh, wall is W A L L. Paco, next to le pusieron a la primera reunión. Paco, yeah. this this uh this was your first week with us? Yes, because I wasn't able to uh to join to the meeting because I am not very good on uh on computer so i miss it uh <laughs> i missed it right. the, the the two first weeks all right okay okay but now you got it uh, now i got it okay since, very good since yesterday since, yeah okay that's good it's good to have you good N Where nice is, to meet you yeah very good <laughs> what's your name is? Junto. excuse me Papa? what's your name jessica Jessica, nice meeting you. Jessica yes, thank nice you. Nice meeting you. Meeting you too, and then you. Very good. If you have any questions, let me know. All right. Okay. Once to next to. Once I work once play soccer. Play soccer. Playing. Playing, Senita, because it's a participle. Playing. Yeah, it has to be playing. playing. Soccer. Very good. Hi, Milton. Hi, teacher. How are you? Very good. Excellent. Very good. Nice to see you. Thanks. And uh, no, no sé de qué se trata la clase. Acabo de entrar, teacher. All right. ¿Se acuerda que ayer estamos hablando de los modifiers with participles and prepositions? Do you yes. remember that? Okay, it's the por same. Cierto, no pude hacer... Por cierto, no pude completar lo de la plataforma. Era el 4.13, ¿cierto? Ya. Yeah. All right. Mm -hmm. Lo que pasa es que tenía un error, pero ya salió. Ah, okay. All right. Yeah, very good. Mm -hmm. Okay. So right now, Seni and Ricardo, they are making questions. Using some prompts that I gave already, okay? So maybe Senia or Ricardo, you can share with Milton what the quest, the beginning of the questions were. Can you do that? Yes. Senia, please. Thank you, guys. All right. So Milton, they will help you out, okay? Okay. Great. Which one is the biggest dog? ¿Cuál es el perro más grande? Oh, okay. Which, mm -hmm. Which one is... The biggest, biggest dog. How are you guys doing? Are you, are you guys doing okay? No, yes. Sure. All right. Who are the people? Who are the people? The people. Okay. Hi, Erika. Hi, Cecilia. Hi, Miss. How, How are you? you? 
mejor, mejor, pero todavía así como que, pero mejor, mucho mejor que ella. Ok. All right, very good. Excellent. ¿Y girls finished? La última, la última. rara, pero creo que dice que quiénes son los qué. Yeah, that's right. Very good, Erika. Nice. Tendrí, tendríamos que complementarlo con... With what, Erika? Con who. Who are the ones next to, um, next to you, <laughs> for example. Como estamos preguntando quiénes son esas personas tal y tal, ¿cierto? Uh -huh. Alright, so I say, if, if, imagínense que yo estoy en una fiesta y hay una familia, hay varias gentes a la par suya y le digo, Erika, who are the ones next to you? And you say, you say, ah, they are the uh, Pérez family. Alright? Uh -huh. uh -huh. Alright. O le digo, who are the ones eh, on the sofa? Alright. O who are the ones talking? And they don't shut up, all right? And then you say, oh, they are my uh, brothers. I don't know, something like that. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. All right. We are the ones, the family Lopez. Yeah, who are the ones, uh-huh. So look at the, the Lopez family would be the answer. All right? So you need to, what you need to do right now, Cecilia, is finish, finish up the question. Who are, like I said, who are the ones next to you? Who are the okay. ones in front of us? Let's pretend we're together in one in one room and then there are some people in front of us. And I said, Cecilia, in front of us. And you're like, ah, they are the, the Perez family. I'm like, oh, okay. All right. Or they are Erica's children, for example. All right. Acuérdense que lo que esto nos ayuda es identificar de quienes queremos saber información. De repente hay alguien que yo no sé quién es y yo le pregunto a usted, ¿quién es la mujer que viste, eh, no sé, una um, mil falda? <laughs> I don't know. All right. Okay. Okay. Es que, es que uh -huh. fíjese que como yo lo tenía en el traductor de Google. Yes. Me aparece, por ejemplo, si yo le pongo, ¿quiénes son los que visten? Me aparece otra vez el who. Who dress. Ah, de verdad. Ok. No. Me parece, who are the ones who dress? Who? Ah, no, no, no. That would be wrong. Yeah. No, no. No, no, it can't be. No, no, confiamos mucho al Google Translate. <laughs> sí. Very good. Sometimes it works, but not always. Ok, very good. Ok, gracias. You're welcome. Hello, Vilma. Hello, Will. Hello. How are you? Fine. Yes. Excellent. Fine. Are you guys finished? A little time. Yeah, me too. I'm very happy. It's Thursday. <laughs> okay, yeah. It's the missing tomorrow is Friday. Only yeah. one day. Only <laughs> one day. Yeah, I know. <laughs> very good. Are you guys finished? Uh, yes. Yeah, okay, okay, very good. Okay, so give me a couple of more minutes because some people just came into class and I want them to finish up, okay? So you okay. keep on talking in English with Will. Will is bilingual, so... Okay. <laughs> so you can um, talk to him. Okay. Very good, thank you. Okay. Hi. Hello, Aldair. Hello, Flore. Hi, teacher. Hi, Hello, teacher. How are you? You finished? Yes, we are okay. finished. Okay, very good. Okay, so we're going to go back to the main, main session and we're going to see what kind of questions you guys have, okay? Okay, teacher. Very good, thank you. Teacher. Yes? Um, um, it's true, uh, uh, for example, the sentence in five and um, six, uh, I can say, who are the, the ones wearing, uh, wearing helmets? Wearing helmets? Uh-huh. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, very good. Yeah, no problem. You, remember that you can use a you can use a preposition or whatever you want and it's fine. Oh, okay. It depends, like, for example, 
if you think that giving a participle will give the other person more information of location, then you can use a participle. As in, like, you can identify them faster. All right, yeah. so I said, who are the ones wearing a helmet? So a helmet is very easy to distinguish, right? Yeah. Rather than saying, who are the ones uh, on the sofa? There are many people. All right, hi guys. Hi, teacher. Hi, teacher. hi Anita. Hello. <laughs> Anita, you're not celebrating Valentine's Day tonight? <laughs> no, teacher. Tonight, no. Oh, tomorrow. Night. I celebrate the past week. <laughs> <laughs> All right, that's very good, Anita. Very nice. Okay, and today in class, right, Anita? <laughs> All right, guys, very good. So we have um, we have the, the uh, questions that we were, I was showing to you. All right, so let's see, who wants to do number one? I wanna, I wanna hear your questions, okay? So let's see what you have. Um, who's the man sitting next to? ¿Qué tienen para eso? A ver, give me yes. Okay. Who the man sitting next to the table? Así puso al grupo en el que estaba. Who's the man sitting next to? Table. Next to the table. All right. Okay. Who's the man sitting next to the table? Oh, very good. Nice. Another example for number one, guys. Anybody else? Who is the man sitting next to my brother? Excellent. Who's the man sitting next to my brother? Very good. Another example. Nice example, Penny. Who is the man sitting next to window? Next to the window, very good. Okay, nice. Another example. Who's the man sitting next to the wall? Okay, who's the man sitting next to the wall? All right. Alguien castigado. <laughs> very good. Anybody else? Paco, Paco. I am. That's me. I am sitting next to the wall. Oh, you're you're punished, Paco. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, Paco, I didn't know. Yeah. <laughs> All right, that's okay. okay. All right, very good. Excellent, guys. What about number two? A ver, alguien que no me ha dado ningún aporte en la uno, so you can try different no, yeah. Who's the woman wearing a dress? Who's the woman wearing a dress? Very good, nice. Uh -huh. Anybody else? Who's the woman wearing a helmet? Wearing a helmet, very good, yes, okay. Anybody else? Who's the woman wearing uh, sunglasses? Who's the woman wearing sunglasses? Very good. Remember, don't put up because uh, I singular. Nice. A ver, someone else, the last one for number two. Who's the man wearing a dress jacket? Who's the woman wearing a dress jacket? Okay, very good. Okay, number three. Give me examples. Who is the man's standing? Standing up. Who's the man is standing up? Very good. Nice. I like that question. Very good. Another one. Who is the girl behind to the sofa? Who is the girl behind the sofa? Not to the sofa, just the sofa, okay? Who okay. is the girl? Uh-huh. Who is who is the Yes, tell me. Who is? Who is the neighborhood? Oh, who is? I don't know. Um, I don't know, Erica. Let's, let's try to reward that question. Uh, you can who say is in neighborhood. Yeah, but mm, let's let's make it more complete. Uh, Michelle, can you help us with that example that Erica gave us? Uh, maybe who is your neighbor? But then we're not using participle, we're not using mm -hmm. a preposition. Who is the, uh -huh. who is the neighbor sitting next to your mother? Okay, who is the neighbor sitting next to your mother maybe? Okay, yes. All right, very good. Any, anything else with who is? Anita, you had a, a, a question? Who is the boy swimming in the pool? Excellent. Who is the boy swimming in the pool? Very good example. All right, let's see. Number four, which one is Henry? 
Henry to? Henry. Henry, uh -huh. Which one is the girl next door? Which one is the girl next door? Mm, ¿Para qué quieres saber? <laughs> Henry, Henry. Question. Ah, it's only an example, right, Henry? That's <laughs> okay. Hey, Joanna, another example. Which one is the biggest dog? Which one is the Which one is the biggest dog? Which yeah, one? pero ahí no estoy usando ni participio ni preposición. Okay. Which one is wearing the black skirt? Which one is wearing the black skirt? Okay. Black y podemos skirt. A skirt, yeah, black skirt. Remember that we can replace one for a girl, all right, or lady. Okay. So who is the la which one is the lady? All right, very good. Um, Joanna, no, 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 Fredito, number five. Who are the people? <coughs> Excuse me? Who are the people in your house? Who are the people in my house? All right, you're using the preposition in. All right, anybody else? Who are the people playing soccer? Okay, very good. Very good. Uh, Sergio, ¿está por ahí, Sergio? Sergio, Sergio, lo vi por Who ahí. are the people near uh, the supermarket? Near the supermarket. All right, very good. Okay. Who are the people dancing at the party? Who are the people dancing at the party? Oh my goodness, guys, your questions are very good. Se merecen muchos chocolatitos. Me voy a comer todo. Sí. Very good. All right, Vinita, who are the ones? Number six. Okay, who are the ones eating in my house? Oh, okay, de repente en Chopi me hay un montón de gente, ¿verdad? Who are the ones eating in my house? Oh my goodness. Okay, very good. Any other example? Uh -huh. uh, who are the ones driving in the Havali? All right, okay, very good. Nice. Who are, who are the people talking around the pool? Who are the people talking around the pool? Who are the ones talking around the pool? Excellent, guys. I think you have understood the topic, which that makes me very, very happy. Do you have any questions so far? Uh, teacher, no? I have a question. Yes, Ricardo. I, question. Uh, I can use who, can I use? who can is, I use? Who is uh, when, when I need to talk in about uh, an animal, for example, no, you, it, it's better to use which. Which one? Re, yeah, rem, yeah. Remember the who is just for people. Oh, uh, just for okay. Uh -huh. So in that case, you can use which for animals or objects. Okay. All right. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Very good. All right. Vamos a regresar. We're gonna go back to the breakout rooms. Y porque como ya tienen sus preguntas, or right, for example, you had who are the ones talking around the pool. So I will ask Ricardo, for example, Ricardo, y voy a hacer las cinco preguntas. I'll say, for example, la que me acuerdo ahorita. Ricardo, who are the ones talking around the pool? And Ricardo will say, ah, Jennifer and Cristina are the ones talking around the pool. All right? So you give the answer. This case, we're going to give long answers, okay? Yo podría decir nada más Jennifer and Julia. And I finish, all right? But because we, we're trying to learn and we're trying to remember what the, the structure is, I want you to say, Jennifer and Julia are the ones uh, talking around the pool, the whole sentence. All right, you understand? Yes. Guys, you understand? Yes, yes. Vamos a trabajar con las mismas preguntas y voy a hacer rotación de grupo ahorita, okay? Pero no van a estar con la misma persona. All right, we're going to switch right now. Entonces, si estoy trabajando, ahora Freddy no trabaja con Michelle, sino que con Vilma Olivares, entonces Fredito le va a hacer las que tiene usted, con las, las que hizo con Michelle, se las va y Vilma le va a contestar. Y Vilma estaba trabajando con Will, no, no me acuerdo quién estaba. Well, it doesn't matter. All right, so you will ask your questions to Freddy. They are not the same questions anymore, all right? So you have different questions, so for you to practice speaking. Sí, eh, les pido que practiquen para que, para que aprovechen el tiempo, ¿verdad? Right? Bye. Okay. Uh, how many participants I have? All right, I have. 
yourself go. All right. Okay, guys. So you're gonna rotate people. Please start clicking on your um, breakout rooms. The join button. Hi, Claudita. Hi, Claudia Patricia. Claudita, Ana. Ana, ¿qué pasó, Anita? What are your breakout rooms, girls and guys? Claudia, Julias. All right. Aníbal, what happened, Aníbal? Carlos. It's Carlos. Number two. Who's the no, two. who's the woman wearing a red dress? The woman wearing a red dress is my mother. Okay. Or Michelle, you can give it, you can switch the whole structure. You can say my mother is the one wearing the red dress. You can do it either way. All right, very good. Mm -hmm. Okay. Thank you. Senita, ya no le da la cabeza? Ayer andaba con la rabia. Okay, ya igual yo. Sí, no terminé, no terminé la clase. Sí, no, yo hubiera querido tampoco, pero no puedo. <laughs> All right, pero aquí vamos, very good. Hoy estamos más tranquilos, ¿verdad? No hay mucho sonido ahora. Excellent, guys. Girl power, yeah. <laughs> very good. All right, keep on working. Very good. Okay. Okay. Who is, mire, yo no sé si está bueno, pero who is the, the pretty girl? Who is the pretty girl? Yes. Okay. Violeta, le falta un poquito más ahí. ¿Puedes terminar esa okay. pregunta? ¿Con una participle or with a preposition, Violeta? Okay. Who, I, I, who is I have, okay. that, that pretty, no, that, who is, ay, ya me topé. Voy a hacer that, la pregunta yo. Ajá, okay. yo le respondo. Uh, ajá. Yeah. Who is the man stand up standing. next to the table? Milton, standing, standing up. Yes. Acuérdense que usamos participles por prepositions, all right? Yes, el, pre, el participle okay. is ing. Ing, mm -hmm. en preposition is. Standing. In, on, for example, I can say who, okay. Violeta, I can say who is the pretty girl um, next to Javier. Okay. And then you say, ah, eh, I don't know. That girl is, ajá. Uh -huh. Okay. My sister. She's okay. my sister. Oh, the pretty girl uh -huh. next to Javier is my sister. Sí, right. me quedé con el, ajá, me faltó. Tiene me faltó, ajá. Uh -huh. uh -huh. eh, porque nosotros decimos who is the pretty girl, así ya lo sabíamos, ¿verdad? Pero ahorita es como agregarle un poquito más, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. Usando prepositions or participles. Uh -huh. Ok. Que ya hay de nivel okay. intermedio, ¿verdad? <laughs> <laughs> sí. Very good, yeah. Excellent, very good. Okay. Milton, usted dijo de menos... Who is the uh, man standing? Standing up next to the table. Okay. In this case, Violeta, si se fija, Milton está usando participle and a preposition. Uh huh. So next it's longer, to the which is okay. It's fine. Very good. Entonces podemos decir eh, the man standing next to the table is my my brother. Excellent. Excellent. Okay. Or my children. Oh, yeah, whatever, whoever you want. Yeah, that's fine. Mm -hmm. He's my brother. My children. Okay. In the car, you are driving. 
Uh -huh. He is driving. You are driving. Which one is the car you are driving? Uh, um, you can say okay. I'm driving the I'm driving the blue car. The Mercedes. <laughs> <laughs> the Mercedes. All right. Very good. Okay. Okay. Who are the people drinking uh, in the bar? No conocen un bar. <laughs> I don't. I don't know. I don't, I don't know. Ah, excellent. <laughs> Very good, guys. Okay, the last. Hi, Claudita. Hi, Claudia. Hi. Hi, Claudita. How are you? Sí. I'm fine, very good. Claudita, tell me I'm fine. I'm fine. Yes, sí, aquí estoy. Oh my goodness, se oye lejos. Sí, se me arruinó en la computadora y el micrófono está malísimo, pero ahí estoy escuchando las clases. All right, very good. Okay. So, okay, um, pero han logrado um, trabajar con Claudia Patricia, Claudia. Eh, más o menos. Más o menos. Sí. Okay, very good. Okay. Ajá, trabajamos algo. Okay, no very good. No sé si lo copiamos. Ajá. Ajá, no sé si lo copiamos tal cual, vea, pero podemos darle respuesta. Okay, very good. Okay, that's good. That's good. Okay. Na, na one. Ajá. Who's the main? Who's the main? City next to the door. Okay, very good. How would be the answer? Uh, who's the woman wearing short? Uh -huh. A short. Okay. Wearing shorts, no a shorts. Wearing shorts. All right, very good. Okay. Uh, let's see next. Yeah. Who is my daughter? Mm, pero a esa le falta algo a la pregunta. Or a participle or a, uh, or a, or a preposition. Uh -huh. All right. Entonces, en ese caso, no podríamos we, preguntar mi hija, okay. porque obviamente es mi hija. ¿Verdad? Podríamos preguntar, Claudia, who uh -huh. is the girl eh, wearing pajamas? Y me dice, my daughter is wearing pajamas. Oh. All right. So remember that with this type of question, we, we need a participle or we need a preposition to make the question longer. All right, because the idea here is to be able to uh -huh. give reference so the other person identifies who we're talking about. Okay, because I say, who is my daughter? I don't know. All right, or I say, oh, she's your daughter. Ajá. Entre el participio y el, y el, ¿cómo se llama el otro? El, la preposición. La preposición, ajá. Acuérdese, acuérdese, Claudita, le voy a enseñar esto, no sé si, estuvo ayer en clase, Claudia, ¿o bien? Sí, estuve, pero me siento algo perdida con el tema. Vaya, espérame, le voy a enseñar una cosa aquí. A ver, tenemos Claudia, sí. Entonces, Claudia, creo wow. <ríe> Tenemos participle, Claudita. Cuando hablamos de participle, hablamos del verbo más ing. All right? ING. Ajá. Uh -huh. Entonces, eh, y cuando hablamos de preposición, hablamos de in, on, at, behind, cualquier otra preposición. Ok. Tenemos estas acá y decimos, he's the man dancing. Dancing in the living room. Si se fija, dancing. 
eh, dancing es un participio, exacto. Yo no, lo que no puedo hacer, Claudia, es poner he's the, man, he's the man dance, por ejemplo. Tengo que usar he's the man dancing in the living room. Y en este caso, en esta, pregu o en esta oración estoy usando participle and preposition. Dancing in the living room, lo cual está perfecto. Pero si se fija abajo, dice she's the girl wearing a dress. Ahí nada más estoy usando a participle. Lo que estos hacen, Claudia, es darme más información de la persona de quien yo quiero saber y le doy referencia, por ejemplo, yo estoy hablando con usted y le digo, Claudia, ¿quién es la chica eh, que está cantando? All right, who's the girl who's, uh, who's the girl? Solo va a haber una chica cantando, entonces es más fácil usted ubicarla y decirme, ah, das Claudia Patricia. ¿Verdad? Entonces nos ayuda a dar más referencia <risa> para que la otra persona nos diga es fulanita o es sutanita o es quien sea, ¿all right? Puede ser que la persona no esté haciendo ninguna acción, solo esté ahí, ¿verdad? Entonces ahí puedo usar una preposición. Le digo, eh, who's the girl eh, next to uh, Senia? Y se me dice, ah, eh, Joana is the girl next to Senia. All right? Entonces puede usar o preposición o participio y, y los dos están perfectamente bien. Los dos, ambos me ayudan a dar referencia para que la otra persona se ubique uh -huh. y me pueda dar respuesta. ¿Ya? Ya. Yeah. Uh -huh. ¿Más o menos así? Uh -huh. En el caso de comida. Uh -huh. ¿Qué pasa, Carlos? En el caso de comida. Ajá, en el caso de comida, que es eat... Eh, se le pone también, si lo quiero poner en, en, en participio, me quedaría eating. Ya. Yeah. Uh -huh. Sí, sí. Con in. Sí. Uh -huh. Sí. Vaya. Y en este caso, si yo le agrego en el who is my daughter, eh, ahí le agrego eating, está... No. Lo que pasa es que ahí no puedo decir quién es, porque entonces ya no tiene sentido mi pregunta. ¿Sí me entiende? Yo no puedo decirle, ¿quién es mi hermana? Cantando, no, no tiene sentido. Tengo que preguntar, ¿quién es la chica o quién es la niña que está cantando? Para que usted me diga, mi hija. Ajá. Eh, 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 le voy a explicar cómo lo entendí. Eh, sí. Para, si me están, yo voy a hacer una pregunta o me están haciendo una pregunta, el participio me da la acción que está realizando el verbo, el sujeto, y la preposición, el lugar donde lo está eh, haciendo. Excelente, Claudia. Ya. Yeah. Ah, hoy sí, ya lo entendí. Uh -huh. sí, ya lo entendí. Y si se fija, puedo también hacer el tipo de pregunta. O, bueno, tengo, puedo contestar dando la, la acción que está haciendo y dónde está ubicado. Por ejemplo, en la primera, he's the man dancing in the living room. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. O sea, ¿puedo utilizar las dos cosas o solo uno? Más que todo dependiendo de la acción que está realizando. Porque y si no está usando ninguna acción, no está realizando ninguna acción, o es sea, una preposición porque lo ubico. Ajá, en el... Por ejemplo, si hay varias personas bailando, por exacto, exacto. En, el, en, la, en el comedor y en la sala, uh -huh, uh -huh. me quiero referir al que está en la sala, ahí utilizo la preposición. Sí, sí, porque como hay varios bailando, entonces no, es como que, bueno, hay varios bailando, no sé, entonces ya, ya yo hasta me pongo a cabecear, ¿verdad? De quién de tantos que están bailando, ¿verdad? Right? Uh -huh. En cambio, en la otra, como se supone que solo es una chica que puede estar usando ese vestido o puede estar comiendo, entonces por eso que no necesito la preposición. That's right, yeah. Very good, uh, Claudita. Asimilado. Uh, <laughs> Very good. Excellent, guys. All right, guys. Um, I have this picture for you. Yes. Can you see it? Yes. 
No, you cannot see it? Yes. Yeah, you can see it. All right. Um, let's, let's work on this right now. I will ask you, okay? I'll say, I'll look at the picture. I'll look at the picture here. I'll say, okay, who is, <laughs> who's the woman wearing, wearing a green dress? Anybody? She is the woman with a brown hair. Okay, she's the woman with brown hair. Uh -huh. Woman, um, ¿cómo se decía gordita? Chubby, chubby, obese. Chubby. Chubby, chubby, uh huh. The teacher is called a uh, fatty. Yeah, you can say that. Sure. Fatty. Like fatty, the fat, fatty, fatty. Yeah, you can say that. Or you can say chubby. All right. So who, who's the who's the woman wearing a green dress? Who is she? Who's the woman wearing a green she dress? Is, she is Martha, the president's wife. Oh uh, my goodness! All right, she's Martha. Who likes dancing? Who likes dancing? Very good. Okay. Who is Who's the boy looking at the men playing the violin? The violin. Who's the, who's the boy looking at the men playing the violin? Uh, the boy. The, the white. The white shirt. Yeah, uh huh. So who's the boy? And but, yeah, but. Cuando yo le pregunto quién es el niño que está viendo al hombre que está tocando el violín, usted me dice, mi hijo. Es mi cousin. My cousin. O me dice, my baby. O dice, el hijo de mi hijo. Es 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 mi hijo. Excellent. My son is the one looking at the man playing the violin. All right. It's very long. Pero lo que necesito es que su cerebro lo procese tal cual, ¿right? Una vez usted lo maneje, me dice, my son, y hasta ahí llega, no me tiene que dar todo. All right, very good. Ah, uh, let me see, who's the... No veo. Who's the... Who's the boy, or who's the man, standing by the wall? Wearing blue overalls. Mm. He is the, the grandfather. He is what? He is the grandfather. He is the grandfather. Can be hit on the Ah, no, but not dancing. The one is standing by the wall. Ah, he's Milton. Standing. Ah, he's Milton. Excellent. <laughs> Very good. He's Milton. Very hi, Milton. <laughs> Very good. All right. Who's the who is the old lady with white hair sitting on the chair? She is my grandmother. Excellent. Very good. Nice. She's my grandmother. All right. Very nice. Okay. And the last question. Vamos a ver qué tengo aquí. Who is who is that couple that is looking, they are looking at the people dancing? The people are dancing. Are the people were family. Okay, they are your family, they are your in laws. Mm -hmm. yeah, yeah, they are my family. parents. <laughs> Your parents, parents, yes, your parents. All right, very good. Excellent, guys. Very good. Okay. Chocolate. Uh, chocolate. chocolate. I'm not the sleep in chocolate. All right. Any other chocolate? Mañana lo vamos a llegar a pedir ahí. Ah, vaya, ahí, ahí, ahí. Solo para eso vamos a subir hasta arriba. All right, guys. So it's time to go. 
Uh, we have finished section four. So on Monday, we're going to begin section five. All right. Este mes se fue super rápido y de igual forma será el otro. Así es que póngase las pilas. You guys are in two Hasta... Very good. Yes. Hasta cuando tenemos. Teacher, ¿hasta cuándo tenemos para contestar el, el, el medium test? Hasta Sunday. hoy a las 12. No, Sunday. No, no, no. Oh, no. For Sunday. Sunday night. Una pregunta. Okay. Finish, teacher. Sunday. Sunday. Me hizo una pregunta. Dígame, Erika. Mire cómo se, cómo se dice esto. Si las personas... Thumbs up. 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 Okay. okay. All right, guys. So have a good weekend. For the Vayan a celebrar eh, Valentine's Day. Ya les, ya les doy permiso. <laughs> All right. Very good. Very good. Oh, really? Gracias. Me ha dejado de decir antes. Hoy no le dejo tarea porque vaya a celebrar. Así que vaya. Excellent. Excellent. All right. Thank so, you. See you next week, guys. Have a great weekend. Okay. Cualquier cosa me escriben. Bye. 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 Bye